Hi guys, uh, welcome to my channel. My name is Violet and today is another day and amazingly it's another thrift day for me. It was completely unexpected um, and here's why. So I had a bunch of, of um, errands to run. One of them is around the thrift store, thrift store that I love to come to which is a um, Goodwill boutique here in Orange County. And so I have a little bit of time to spare and I am going to go ahead and bring you guys along with me to a quick thrift trip and see what we can find. Again, I'm still in the hunt for some uh, spring items. Of course, if I do some, you know, find something else that I love, I am going to go ahead and grab it and buy it and take it home, uh, make it mine. So yeah, let's go ahead and head on to uh, the thrift store. All right, so today I started off with the jeans. Now I did find a pair, but I didn't film that part because there was a lady next to me and I didn't want her to think that I was filming her. But um, you will see those jeans um, later on. And so I'm not looking for anything in particular, just, you know, as long as they're in my size, they're um, petite and they're, or cropped, where I don't need to hem them because what I do, what I've done in the past is buy them, I don't get them hemmed, and they're just sitting in my room for months and months and months. Anyway, moving on, I went to check out the frames, artwork, whatnot, and it was packed with things. I didn't want to move them much because I felt like I would have made a disaster. Um, so I didn't mess with it, but I didn't find anything, nor did I find any shoes. So let's move on to blazers. I thought this was nice, um, but the size I believe was too big that's why I didn't grab them plus I also already have some gray uh, I think I have like three blazers three gray blazers already and in regards to sizing I feel like a 36 38 tends to be something that I like at least fit wise uh, but let me know what you guys typically get I feel like that's like a small medium and then oh this one I loved it it's like a almond color so yes I did put it in, put it in my cart but yeah, let me know what, um, I mean, I don't even know sizing, honestly. Is that a 36, 38, like a medium or small? Question, let me know. I thought this one was really nice, but also too big. I like this, you know, very unnoticeable stripes. I don't know the brand. <laughs> Looks nice though. Then I found these Style & Co pants in my size, 8 petite. But spoiler alert, I didn't get them. I felt like they were going to be a little bit too tight on my legs, almost like a skinny pant. Um, so I, I, I'm not looking for that. So I, I eventually um, did leave them. And then, you know, I do need to check on the grains. So here I am checking green pants. I didn't find anything. That was sort of cute. Oh, I like this one. It was like a yeah suede. I, I like the lines, everything. But I I know I like oversized jackets, but for some reason not in suede. I think had it been like a fitted coat, uh, blazer, it would have been Chef's Kiss, and I would have gotten it. But obviously, not that big, or not that one. Anyway, I found this um, sports bra with its tag but I don't need any so obviously I didn't get it I was cute but two sizes too big for me vintage though 
at least the tag looks vintage. And then, like I said, I check out all the greens, green tops, green pants, green everything. So here we are. Um, this is what I ended up with in my cart. This one I didn't grab. I thought it was really cute, but the sleeve was like a three-fourth sleeve. So um, no, just wasn't what I was looking for. Um, and then I tried this jacket on. I was totally thinking a denim on denim outfit with this. I love the oversize of it. So yes. Yes, yes, yes. I took it home. I believe I, it was $10.99 or $14.99. And tell me, this is not cute. It's amazing. I loved it. I loved, you know, the oversized sort of fit to it. Not too big, not too tight. It was perfect. So yes, I took it home and that was $14.99. Uh, too big. They were petite, but too big. And those are the denims that I mentioned earlier in the in the video. This one, it was cute, but I did carefully inspect it and it had like little specks. I don't know if you can see it, like little red ones. I'm like, I don't even know how I'm gonna take this out. So I did leave that one as well. And that was that. Okay, so Mirror tech. I just left the other thrift store. You saw the two items that I got. Now, I still have a little bit of time, so I came to a different thrift store. Never had been here, so let's go check it out. All right, so I do want to start off by saying this is the biggest Goodwill I've ever been to. And so I know I'm looking for spring, um, items but I did want to just you know check and see what kind of brands they have and you know so that's why I'm checking out the sweaters I think this was a uh, no it's not I thought for a second it was made well but no 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 I did notice uh, that they had a bunch of um, old navy jeans and also a lot of Target I thought that was cute, but I don't you sh I, I don't have anything in that color, and I think it's because honestly, I don't think I love it on me. So, yeah. Plus, I don't need a top like that. Cute, but also not my style. I thought this was really cute. I liked the stitching, but I have. A couple of black bat purses so I don't need it again if I don't need it if I don't love it I'm not just gonna buy to buy you know and goodness I really like this one I did grab it just because I was like well maybe but I didn't buy it and that's because it had the edges were a little bit like worn out you can't see it in the video, but it, it was worn out, and um, so I did leave it behind. And then, so I've been, uh, first, I'm gonna say this, I've been like pinning a lot of Copenhagen um, styles, and so um, in them, these girls are wearing like these, um, you know, red purses, so I'm like, oh, it'd be nice, you know, to, to have a red purse and, you know, pair it with, um, you know, outfits similar to the ones I have pinned in my Pinterest. And what happened? I found that purse on this trip. So that was good. I didn't get anything from here, but I did think about that Bansky frame, um, but it was almost like a poster. It wasn't in the greatest condition or nor material, so I didn't take it. I do have to say this, they do have a bigger selection in um, their picture frames. Also, their furniture. 
and I'm assuming it's obvious, obviously because it's a bigger store. Um, and also with their furniture, a lot of Target, but the prices are high, too high if you ask me. So I checked out most of the aisles and ended up just leaving with the purse and also some pants, some trousers. I couldn't, I didn't film it because there was, I'm pretty sure someone around and I didn't film because I was shy, but I did get some trousers, uh, trousers that I'm going to show you later on. Hey guys. All right. So I'm back in my car. Um, that was, I don't know. Um, I didn't love that Goodwill. It was, um, so I ended up going to a second, sorry, let me start over. I ended up going to a second, um, store. It's about, or Goodwill, it's about seven minutes from where we were at. Um, I still had a little bit of time to spare. So I'm like, okay, let me just, just head on over there. So I did first time, didn't love it. Um, I don't think I would probably go back. That's okay though, because I did find some gems. Um, let me show you. Sorry, I'm holding my phone. And yeah, another thing, I stopped recording because I'm on my phone and my phone was about to die. Um, I just charged it a little bit and decided to you know show you guys what I ended up getting but yeah my phone was about to die so I, I couldn't record anymore and it was also crowded it's weird because uh, it's a uh, what's today today's a Monday it was pretty busy for a Monday let me tell you that anyway I found you saw me put this in my cart it's a sanctuary little crossbody and as I'm looking over the things that I put in my cart, um, I googled the, I knew the brand, I, I'm, I've seen it at um, Nordstrom, but I searched the bag and it came up, that actual bag came up and um, someone's selling it on Poshmark for like a hundred and I think a hundred dollars and retail price from what they're stating in that Poshmark account, um, $168. So what $200 bag I ended up, um, purchasing for just $7.99. So that was great. Then I found these trousers. Um, in an eight petite because as you know your girl is a shorty and hopefully they fit i decided to just you know buy them although i didn't try them uh because they were only eight bucks so yeah um it's a little bit cheaper i give them that it's just that i you know i don't know maybe i would give it another shot i guess but didn't like love it love it anyway that was a great thrift with me um that was fun and so again very out of the blue very spontaneous for me to head on to the thrift store day to, thrift store today just because again um i have other things to do but you know why not if i had a little bit of time um i'm glad you guys came along with me if you've gone to this um, and you know, part of the video, I do appreciate it. And I would also appreciate if I can get a like from you, a thumbs up and also subscribe. I will continue to post videos like this and yeah, I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.